Welcome back to another edition of Tech Tips Thursday. Oh crap. Okay. I got the new one here. All right. This is much better. All right guys, well welcome back to another edition of Tech Tips Thursday. Today's gonna be a short video. Uh, we're gonna be talking about motorcycle camping. Well, most specifically barbecuing while you're motorcycle camping. So we've had a lot of instances where we went camping and either the place that we're camping didn't have a grill or the grill was just so disgusting we didn't want to cook on it. So I always wanted to bring along a grill, but obviously they're way too big, way too cumbersome, too heavy, and they just take up way too much space to be carrying on a motorcycle. Until I came across this thing. So this is the mini flat pack grill and fire pit. Very compact size, but it's enough to make three servings. So when they say three servings, they're talking about like three burgers. You probably make two steaks and a couple of sides on it. So I pulled the trigger and I decided to pick one up and try it out. And I think this is a, a winner. Now the size of this thing is tiny. It's nine and a half inches by eight inches by one and a half inch thick. I mean, it's tiny. It even comes with its own case, which is really nice. And this is all stainless steel, so it's rust resistant. And what's nice about it also is the sides serve as windbreakers, so you don't have to worry about the wind putting out your fire. And they claim that this is a 30 second setup. So let's check it out. It's only three pieces inside. This is the actual grill. Here's your top. And that's all there is to it. They even give you this little utensil, you would call it. Uh, this is good if you wanna lift it up without burning your hands. You can kinda grab it and move it around if you need to tend to the fire. Um, now this can hold charcoal, regular wood, and even little fire logs. So it doubles as a fire pit also. So if you ever just want to get a fire going, either to stay warm or just for the atmosphere, you can use that as well. Now this comes in two sizes. This is the small size that I took. There's also a bigger size, which is for six servings. And that one is 13 by 10 inches. So I'm gonna be picking that one up too, and I'm gonna keep that in the car just for one one with the family, with the kids, and we just wanna barbecue somewhere. You don't always have a grill, so this will work out. And it's not expensive at all. Uh, the small unit right now is selling for $26.99, and the bigger one, the 13 by 10, is $35.99. Real small price to pay for the convenience of it. Um, I love the fact of being able to make my my meals on my own grill and I like the fact of having a grill with me at all times. It's awesome. I think this thing is just going to live on the bike. The tear apart, it's just as easy as the setup. Just fold it and I mean literally this is everything. This is your whole setup right here. And it comes with a nice case. It's a pretty thick case. It seems to be well made. It's got a nice Velcro on it. So just pop that in there. Throw a little utensil, and that's it. You're good to go. Very compact size. You can see it's tiny. Wouldn't take up too much space. I can throw it in the side case or in the trunk and have a barbecue wherever I am or a fire pit. So definitely recommend trying this out. And speaking of trying it out, let's go outside, cook up a couple of burgers, see how it actually works.
Just like the bird is done. I could use another minute. And I know what we're missing. Can't barbecue without a beer. Well, when you forget your bottle opener, just grab your key. And there you go. Popped me in the face, but it'll work. That's good. All right, guys, well, what can I say? I'm impressed. It did the job, it fit really well on the bike. It's very compact, very slim. So very happy with it, well worth the price. No complaints yet. Time will tell how, how it'll hold up, but uh, it seems to be well made. It seems to be pretty strong and durable. So I don't see anything going wrong with it anytime soon. Well, that about wraps it up. Let's get back to the studio and we'll wrap up the video. I gotta admit, that was a pretty good burger. So, as you can see, unit works really well. I'm very happy with it. It's definitely a keeper, something I'm gonna be bringing on all my bike rides from now on. It's practically just gonna live on the bike. And uh, by the way, happy Thanksgiving, everyone. And because it's Thanksgiving and you made it all the way to the end of this video, we're gonna give thanks as well. I got another unit here. We're gonna be doing a giveaway. All you gotta do is Hit the like button. You have to be a subscriber, obviously, and drop a comment below saying, give thanks. That's all you gotta do. And we'll draw a winner, not this Sunday, but the following Sunday coming, and we'll get you out your grill. Now, in the meantime, I also had received the bigger one. I did order it and it got delivered overnight. So just give you a little side by side. That's the little one, that's the big one. And this is the one that's gonna live in our car. So, like I said, it's well worth the money. I think it's a great investment. It's something we're gonna get a lot of use for over the years. And I definitely recommend picking one up. Of course, I'm gonna leave a link in the description. If you decide you do wanna get one, you use our link. We'd appreciate it. We do get a small commission. Doesn't cost you anything extra, but it does help us grow the channel and purchase more gear to review and do giveaways for you guys. So if you did get anything out of this video, we appreciate you hitting that like button. And if you're new here, consider subscribing for more reviews like this and giveaways. So with that said, I'm Mike, Mr. and Mrs. Two-Wheeler, and as always, we'll see you on the road. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone.